I guess I'm probably going to get a shot at it if I move up to here. Yep, here's a reaction shot. Welcome back to Dan Plays XCOM after that last little recording mishap. Uh, I'm back and I'm ready to sort of get this going again. Um, I'm probably going to lose this mission, but we'll see. Alright, so there's a kill. Alright. Burgess, Duarte, can't see anybody. I'm going to move forward because he's got the best weapon. Right now I can see somebody. 45% chance to hit. Let's see. Cool. Plasma weapon does 5 damage. Alright. Now there's movement over there in the spaceship. Of course, Duarte is in a bad position for that, so I'm going to move her to over here and put her in Overwatch. And move him to over here. Put him in Overwatch. And get Robbie over to here put him in overwatch there we go and I think we're being flanked so of course every reactor shot ever always misses like three of them that was three reaction shots that missed guys so now these guys are getting set up to kick my ass okay so He's being flanked, so he needs to definitely move. He's gonna move over here. Alright, he can't see anybody, but whatever. Alright, so these guys can see him with a 20% 20, 20 chance to hit. I'm gonna try and move a little closer. Alright. Now 38% chance to hit. And a much more dangerous position. Yay! Alright, that's a miss. I don't... Is he in cover? Really? Against those guys? Whatever, I shouldn't really question it. 15% chance to hit is ridiculously small. Um, I don't know that moving into the ship is a good idea, though. Maybe... Maybe I'll be able to... Uh, to flank him, but I don't think that's how it's going to work. Yeah, that wall is pretty solid. So, maybe what I should do... We're down to here so that she can see both of them. And now, that's probably why I didn't hit, by the way, because it's only a 50% chance to hit. Alright, that was a miss. Wallace is going to move over here. Actually, what I should have done is moved him there, but that's what I wanted to do, but that's not what I did. He's going to move back to here. Oh, he doesn't have any contact at all with the aliens. Um... It's gonna be in Overwatch, I guess. And yeah, he can't really hit either. Maybe if I move him to over here, it's a dashing location. Um, I'm gonna retreat him a little bit. And that actually puts him out of vision of anybody. So if these guys start to move forward like they do, all right. Did not did not see him. He didn't pop into eyesight. Now he's going to buff his buddy. His buddy is going to come and probably pound me to death. Nope. Just have a perfect shot right there. That can't miss. So we're going to get some panic going now. They hunker down. Thank God. It's better than shooting my guys in the face. He's going to shoot and miss, thankfully, because he was shooting at the person right next to him. He's panicking too. But he's actually going to shoot at an enemy and actually hit an enemy, so he's my new best friend. Still panicking. Still panicked. Alright. That was ridiculous, y'all. Um, there's a corpse there. Can't get, a, can't get it in a good position, or a position that I'd want to be in. But... I guess this is about as best as I can do. And of course, that was a dash. I didn't think about it, so now he's stuck there and he didn't get to move. So he's going to get probably shot to death. Yep. That's another death. Let's see if my boys panic again or if they uh, actually do something useful. Alright, that's a miss. Thankfully. Alright, Hunter. Nope, you can't see anybody. You barely have any ammo because you wasted it all just shooting at nothing. Um, I 
guess we'll move you closer to here. Should have tried the flank is what I should have done. That was a dash? That's for, that's preposterous. Um, maybe a grenade? I guess that's only three damage though, so. Let's take a shot that there's no way I was gonna hit. He can still see that guy with a 35% chance to hit, so he's gonna take this shot. Yes. Maybe I should try and uh, try and flank him a little bit better. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try and move around to this side. Otherwise, I'm not pressing my advantage. Yeah, here comes probably a kill shot because that guy can just kill everything from right there. All right, let's see if they panic. Yep, she panics. Moves into out of cover and into a very dangerous non-defensible location, so he's going to move over here, because I'm trying to flank. And she's going to get ice now. Here it comes. Oh, he's not even going to do it by, by hand. He's going to throw a grenade. That's not going to kill her, but it's going to pretty much own all the cover, and now he's going to probably take a pretty clean shot right there. No, he's going to buff his friend. Well, that means that he's left me with a pretty clean shot. I just need to get behind cover. Not that it'll matter with their little stupid buff. I guess she's theoretically behind cover, but she's out of ammo. So maybe she's going to throw a grenade of her own, huh? Maybe you didn't think of that. And hopefully that hits. But he intimidated her. And she's panicking. Alright, he's out of ammo, of course. So I can't take advantage of this great position that I put myself in. Michelle gets shot. He's just... They're not even bothering to stand in cover now. They're not even afraid. And now he's flanking me, I believe. Yep. Okay, so... I guess that's a dash move if I get him over here. But maybe if I get him over here, I can still see both of them. Alright, so that's 35% to hit, that's 55 because he's just out in the middle of nowhere, so I'm going to take that shot. He's down to one health. Let's see what they do now. He shoots. Of course he gets a lucky hit. He shoots. Maybe. Nope, he just stands there. Nope, here comes a shot. And of course he gets a hit. And that's another mission that I lost in China. So pretty much, I don't think I can I can win anymore. So I'm just gonna fast forward and just keep ignoring missions until I, I get a lose, and so we can see what that looks like. And then uh, in the next episode, I guess we'll start uh, my next ill-fated journey. Uh, it won't be a tutorial one though, so that's nice. So I'll be able to actually pick my starting location much better. Everybody killed in action. I don't have any money really so let's just go to mission control scan for activity plasma rifles yay let's read this um considerable mass alien plasma rifle outer frame reduce the weight without compromising power output or accuracy larger weapon several kilograms overall damage additional modifications a highly advanced mobile plasma discharge weapon that improves nearly all aspects of the conventional x9 they're on standby to make it and we can also recover them so cool that's pretty neat uh, I guess we'll work on the skeleton suit until the game ends, so. Let's see, the satellite uplink should be up now. Maybe I can launch some satellites and then uh, have myself just get totally owned. Yes, this is a long cutscene. It's very nice. It's very pretty for access. Uh, I wonder if these XCOM guys know how doomed they are. Probably not. Situation room, we can launch a satellite, but we don't have any satellites available, really. Do we have oh we have to build them in engineering. So let's let's sell some stuff. So we can uh um so we can buy another satellite. I think they're like eighty five, so alright. That means engineering is gonna build me a satellite. Manufacture, submit the order. Okay, so now 20 days until I get a new satellite, of course, it's not going to be instantaneous. Commander, Council is requesting my your presence. Secure transmission coming in now. Let's go over here. Let's see what this is about. Uh, an extraction. 
Alright, not now. I don't even know if I have any soldiers, do I? Let me look at the barracks. As the alien attacks I've only got one soldier. Our casualty rate has climbed. Let's hire another guy. Is becoming a problem. But remember, I'm just gonna actually just let it go until I, I lose. So let's just scan, ignore the adduction sites, keep scanning. Panic in Canada. Keep scanning. You soldiers are here. We're gonna skip the skeleton suit thing because I don't um I don't want to spoil that reading for the next time. All right, council report time. Ha. Huh. The inability of this project to maintain the support of yeah, several you think? crucial council members has greatly reduced the effectiveness of both entities. I think I'm about to get disbanded. This entire undertaking was the product of an ill-conceived <laughs> plan, a series of simple misunderstandings met with an Well, it's not like they really helped me out that much. They just kind of screwed me over. The best course of action now is to cooperate Whoa. with the aliens Whoa. for the betterment of all mankind. This is really creepy. We are of one mind about this. The path ahead is clear. Wow. That's all the... Oh. That was really freaky. If they've got the council, then that means they know where I am, too. Classic difficulty. They survived. 92. Um... Battles fought 12. I won 9 battles. I lost 3. Killed aliens. Lost 32. <sighs> I think that's it. Yep. So thanks for watching Dan Plays XCOM. You got to see what a lose, what a loss looks like. Oh, in their next episode, we'll start up a new game and uh, hopefully do much better.